Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the FIS show. Uh, we're here in the FIS media room at uh, PPDF um, Private Sector Day. And I'm here with Juliet Musesa Zulu That's right. of Chiawa Safaris. That's so right. welcome to the FIS show, Ms. Zulu. Thank you and, very much. Uh, um, we'd just like to uh, interact briefly with you to find out uh, how your day is going and uh, what you think about the PPDF and if you have any affiliations and interactions with it at all. So please. Okay. Um, as uh, Chiawa Safaris, we are very, very excited to be here in the sense that uh, it's not every day that uh, you get a sitting president that can take time to come in and uh, spend time with uh, stakeholders uh, in, the, um, uh, in, in, in the industries. And uh, this is even more special mm -hmm. because um, tourism is the third wheel that uh, drives our economy. And uh, being given an opportunity to be able to interact with other uh, stakeholders as well as the public sector itself, it's uh, really very exciting and uh, to be able to have the president be in our midst mm -hmm. uh, for him to come in and listen to our uh, problems and also our successes. Yeah. Um, in tourism we like to say that we are the ambassadors of this country mm -hmm. uh, to the world and uh, to be able to sit in the same room with him and be able to share some of our good stories as well as some of our challenges mm -hmm. is really something that is very exciting. So yes, I'm very, very excited uh, to be here at uh, Private Sector Day. Okay, so you've um, been affiliated with uh, PPDA for, for, for a while, have you? Can you tell us a little bit about that? Uh, yes, as uh, Chiawa Safaris, we have been affiliated with uh, PPDF um, for the last two years since its inception mm -hmm. when the president uh, requested that you'd like to have a day when he can be able to uh, talk to uh, key uh, uh, players that run the economy. And uh, this is our second year that we are in attendance and uh, very, very hopeful. We are already beginning to see some changes coming in um, into the sector. And so we are very, very excited uh, mm -hmm. to be part and parcel of uh, uh, this uh, intervention. Okay, so how do you see uh, the tourism sector unfolding in, in, in the future? Because uh, over the last few years, obviously it's had some difficulties coming out of COVID. Mm -hmm. And then of course with uh, economic downturn that that brought on. And then of course with other events happening in the world that might have put pressure on tourism. How is that shaping up now going into the future? How do you see it? Uh, one of the exciting things that I would like to uh, share about uh, us getting out of COVID is the fact that the president uh, um, declared that uh, visas be waived uh -huh. uh, for our international visitors. I think that was the first step that, uh, that has been made. Again, thank you for this intervention. Mm -hmm. And uh, we have a lot of guests that are now coming in and the industry is really beginning to uh, shape up and uh, things are looking good. And uh, as Chiao Safaris, we're very excited that uh, not only um, ourselves, but um, the business is being shared mm -hmm. and um, the spoils are being received right through to um, the lowest person in our communities. Okay. So we're very, very excited to be part and parcel of um, something that is driving the economy of this country. So um, Private Sector Day here at uh, the PPDF uh, Summit or, or conference is just kicking off. What are you looking forward the most to? Um, we are really looking forward to be able to uh, see a bit more um, um, involvement um, with our supporters uh, that support the industry. When guests arrive, they arrive through airports, for example, they arrive yeah. through borders. Um, we would like to be able to see a bit more um, understanding for some of our guests that, are, for example, those that are traveling through borders, they come in self-drive. Mm -hmm. So we would like to be able to see much more um, on the uh, ZRA as well as uh, immigration front to be much more uh, hospitable to these people that are coming in, uh, to be able to cut off some of the paperwork um, that is there to allow them to come into the country, to visit the country. Um, we have what is not in other countries and so we're very, very excited to be able to be part and parcel to be able to um, compel government mm -hmm. to work with us in order that we can be able to have more people come okay. to visit our national parks, visit our natural uh, wonder, the Victoria Falls, and also, of course, uh, explore our culture mm -hmm. um, in the country. 
Well, it's been a pleasure to have you on the fifth show. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Clarence Chongo. This is the fifth show. We are on fifth shots in the fifth media room. Get to know. Thank you very much. Thank you.